Welcome back to my channel. Now back to Family Guy Best Moments number ninety one. And before I get into this, I just want to say please have a subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, really helps to our channel. Also, check out my Rumble channel down below in the description because the Rumble channel posts free full length TV show movie reactions. And most lately, most lately, I've been, mo I've been posting movie reactions over on the Rumble channel. So if you got any reaction requests, leave them down below in the comments. But let's check this out. Guarantee it's gonna get copyright. Oh well. Is is it your line? I don't, uh, no, I don't think so. I'm, I'm sorry, whose line is it? Cut. What the cut? <laughs> that was Peter's line. Where's Peter? Sorry, I was in my trailer eating fancy nuts and smoking. All right, everybody, take five. Take okay, five? I'll be in my dressing room playing online poker. That's me asking for oh, help. Oh, I thought take five mean like they're doing another scene. <laughs> the mayor of Kohog, Adam West. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, Th thank you. Being on this show reminds me of one of my favorite quotes from Macbeth. What's the quote? <laughs> Whoa, I didn't realize this was a trial. <laughs> a yeah, he put you on the spot. <laughs> there are fields for tilling, woods for timber, and always the bounty of the sea. Look at all this sand. You know there are beaches that have black sand? Oh, did I not pack my towel? Are you, are you listening? Because I'm no, trying to help sir. you here. Where's Brian? Breakfast is getting cold. In tonight's episode, the part of Brian the dog will be played by Carter Banks. Here I am. Sorry, I... Camera two. Sorry, I overslept. Yes, well, do you want breakfast or would you rather chew on your own ass as usual? <laughs> nah. Shut up! Shut up! Just shut up! God, keep it to yourself once in a while. Gee. Oh, here, here, look what I'm doing. All right, look, watch this. You're watch not going to cry. You are not going to oh, cry. Oh, oh, see that? See that? Yeah, now try it with me. Huh? Okay? Okay? You're going to cry. You... <laughs> oh. Oh, God. Sorry. Can you give me the line again? Not the whole line, just the end of it. Oh, let's, let, let's cut. All right, you, you, you're sleeping with which producer? God, as soon as my movie deal kicks in, I am such a goose. Ha! Boy, you throw like a fishwife. Come on, you hair and loving friggin' rod. Fresh, are you gonna take that from a fisherman? No way! Oh! There you go. Oh, oh, for the love of peace! Oh, oh yeah, it's great, Damn. you know, doing a show <laughs> with your family. Because what guy doesn't want to go to his office and have his family there? You know, and then you go home after work and catch up with the family. And then, uh, next day, same thing. Just trying to make it to the weekend so you can, uh, spend some time with the family. Isn't that the dream? No. Oh, you weird motherfucker. Why would you do that? Any guy that stands above you while you're sleeping, it, that's just creepy. If someone stood above me while I was sleeping, I think I'd just clock him one. This is disgusting. It smells, it's falling apart, you can hear the mice humping in the wall. <laughs> I'm not so really like a man. I'm a woman. Oh my god, you're a woman? Well, actually, I'm not really a woman. I'm a horse. Whoa, 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 what the hell are you doing? Well, Mayor West is afraid of zombies, so the city says all caskets must be encased in concrete. You'll thank me when no one eats our brains. Oh my god, you're a horse? Actually, I'm not really a horse. I'm a broom. Okay. Ah, zombie! Ah, 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 ah. In the original pilot, I was actually the star. It was called Chris Griffin, Teen Doctor. Sir, I'm afraid I've got some bad news. Well, it can't be any worse than what's in here. <laughs> I ad-libbed that line. I wasn't even supposed to talk. What they didn't know is that I'd been privately doing jokes about the newspaper for years. So, how do you feel? To be honest with you, Diane, I'm surprised. Jeez, Peter. Oh, I can't believe it. Quagmire, Cleveland Joe. Who are you? I'm the guy whose car you just slammed into. <laughs> oh, you invited everyone. <laughs> uh, A lot. Wow. And we're back. Griffins, do you have anything to say to your daughter? I can't. 
can't believe you'd do this to us, Meg. Maybe now I won't give you the antidote. To what? To the poison you just drank. <laughs> See what I mean? This is not normal. But you know, it's not just the Griffins who work hard to make Family Guy what it is. Here in the props department, some sweaty guy is working on the Peter Copter. That's why, right. I was going to say, why is it all of Peter? Don't realize SEAL Team every, sing, every single vehicle there was Peter faced. Pause. That sounded so wrong. Six actually completed their mission in this puppy. Oh, cool! Family guy! Come here. <laughs> ben <Laden. laughs> We have a caller on the line. Go ahead. Yes, yes. I say, do you have Prince Albert in a can? <laughs> quiet, quiet, quiet. Shut up, shut up. Um, well, you'd better let him out. <laughs> that's hilarious. Nah, that's not funny. You know what's funny, you should have said? Do you have Uncle Buck by the bag? Well, you better let him go. <laughs> knock, All knock. Right. Yeah? Hi, Stewie. I was just showing the viewers around Family Guy, and we thought we'd drop in and talk to you about the show. You want to talk about the show? I'll talk about the show. The show sucks. The only reason I stay here is to maintain my profile for my startup business, DiscreetCrepe.com. Hi, are you a straight adult male who likes to eat crepes without people making unwanted crepes are assumptions disgusting. about your private life? Ugh. Hey, let me give you a little tip, Pally. The shortest distance between two points is the full-body English high arc and rainbow shot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're going to jail. Yeah, you don't got the I money to pay for all that. Go to discreetcrepe.com, place your order, and within 30 minutes... Very masculine pizza delivery for Stewie Griffin. Oh, thank you. Mmm, strawberry banana Nutella with raspberry cream. Oh. Now oh, I just need a guy's butt to eat this oh. off. I got myself a night. Nasty. Meg, you have two parents who love you and... What does that say to me? <laughs> Probably more of a bitch than she knows. Uh, than she lets on. Oh, that is hilarious. You shouldn't put that on TV until they're done doing the interview. <laughs> In the post credits or post editing. Oh, go f yourself, Diane. Right? <coughs> she said a swear. Ooh, how deliciously evil looking. It's like something out of Stephen King. Okay, for my 307th book, uh, this couple is attacked by a, a, a lamp monster. Ooh, 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 ooh. You're not even trying anymore, are you? Right. <laughs> When can I have it? Peter, do you think there might be any validity to what Meg is feeling? Who are you calling Uncle Tom? What? Okay, time out. This kind of acrimony isn't going to resolve our differences. Just Maybe? shut up and throw a chair. God damn. Okay. Ah! Of course, every episode of Family Guy starts with the writing. And here we are. The Family Guy writer's room where the writers are hard at work with the show's talented cast. Look, don't get me wrong, guys. I, I think it's hilarious, and, and I totally get that the sex thing is what made me popular, but would it kill us to just once tell a joke that brings glory to God? Black! So Quagmire's and like Quagmire on the show. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Eight years ago, Glenn opened a restaurant where he was spying on ladies peeing in the bathroom. As part of a class action settlement, he entered rehab, and that's where he found Jesus. The restaurant was called Sprinklers. That should that's have been a tip up. off. He still runs Dumpies, but I'm pretty sure Dumpies. that one's legit. Um, Put some clothes on, dude. Toothpaste with a pump is a little easier to get <laughs> on a brush. Um, you might have noticed my underwear has a, has a hole in it. Yeah, it's, it's disgusting. Uh, you know, it's, I, I don't see any reason to, to throw it out. It's The waist is still fine. You know, you can see, see, it's still real stretchy. Peter likes to stay involved in the writing process. <laughs> All right, butthorns, which one of you idiots wrote this script? Uh, I did. Oh, would you write it like on a computer? Yeah. So you know a lot about computers? Y yeah. Can you show me how to turn off the flashlight on my phone? Don't touch my phone. What the hell is this? 
I said egg whites only. Are you trying to give me a bloody heart attack? Make it again. Wow. Ah, uh, the breakfast thing. <laughs> yes. I, it, it wasn't even about the eggs, really. Frankly, I like the yolks. I, I, I don't I have no problem. with. It's just there's always been a lot of tension between Lois and me. Yeah, over the years, Peter's become just a total nightmare. I mean, you know, he's not Jim Belushi. He's not peeing in Snapple bottles on set, which is like what a total the fuck what? But he, he's he's pretty bad. He refuses to interact with any actors on set. He'll only rehearse with helium balloons with crudely drawn faces on them. And it's not so much that I want to kill her. It's just I want her not to be alive anymore. This is great. So far, it's great. I know, knowing me, it's, I'm going to get copyright, obviously. Disney Enterprise or whatever, because now Family Guy's on Disney Plus all the time. <sighs> Disney Enterprise or whatever keeps copying right my Family Guy episodes, or Family Guy funny moments, I should say. It is what it is. One time my dad pooped in the neighbor's yard and then lied about it. I knew it! Hey, they backed up into the Flintstone uh, episode. Peter, you ready to hit the drunken clam? Over. It's difficult having to give up my chair for the balloon, but that's the business we call show. Excuse me, Joe. Look at this, Lois. See, right here. I was voted most likely to succeed. Peter, that's not you. That's not even a yearbook. That's a People magazine. Oh. I wonder why they had the wrong picture and name. Um, on Sundays, we generally catch the early bird special here at the Lobster Shanty. There's fresh seafood, good prices, plus it's a shanty. And you get to pick your own lobster. Yes, yes, that one looks like he's got some fight in him. Take off the rubber bands, I'm going in. The fat man's behavior has been deteriorating for quite some time. And I think someone may have placed an anonymous phone call to the network about it. You have no idea how bad it is here. He screams <laughs> really and yells, he makes a V with his fingers and then licks it like la, 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 which I am to understand is something dirty. <laughs> Please do something. And if possible, I'd love a Master Chef t-shirt. Oh. oh my god, it is them. I can't believe the Griffins eat here like everyday people. We're like trying to eat here. I want those cameras off. Fourth wall. You're breaking the fourth wall. Meg, you're the one that got us on TV in the first place. Well, now I'm getting us off TV. I quit. I demand to see the owner. That's me. I'm Bob Funland. What? You, you own this whole place? Oops. That's Ugh. right. This place is my legacy. So what have you done with your life, you jerk? Uh, uh, Nothing. I'm Neptune, god of the sea. I sink ships and conjure up storms. No, you're not. I am. And you know nothing of my work. Word around the stage is they've decided to finally fire Peter and replace him with another actor. And this time it's permanent. Not like when we killed off Brian for a few episodes so he could shoot that crappy movie. What was it? It was a remake of Old Yeller where the dog gets the drop on him and kills him first. Hello? Over here. Thank you for meeting us here. Can I offer you a cigarette? Peter. Sorry. We have to keep this brief. Why are we here? No cameras. The TV executives don't want viewers to get confused and think you're Meg Griffin. Face it, Lois, I'm a nobody. Huh. Why can't I be famous like Bob or, or, or my cousin Kathy Griffin? Okay, and then I got on Suddenly Susan, and that was, like, really cool. And I still do stand up, and people laugh and give me money, and that's also cool. Ugh, isn't this great catching up? No, it's uh, annoying. And, um, She's was still talking. And, and, I don't and get it. I poured it in her drink. There was this one RA, and his name was C-Rock. Really cool. It was the first black guy I ever did it with. Oh, boy. You know, they say All right, now we're going to use a fan brush here, and uh, I want you to take some hunter green, and we're going to put a happy little bush right down over here in the corner huh. there. And that'll just be our little secret. And if you tell anyone that that bush is there. I will come to your house and I will cut you. So you're just gonna let them recast me? Hey, it could have been worse. They could have gone with plan B. Brian, put a mask on. I have an announcement. Meg Griffin's plane was shot down over the Sea of Japan. It spun in. There were no survivors. Anyways, if y'all like that, please have a subscribe button. Hit thumbs up. Why not leave a comment? Other than that, take care for now.